Hello and welcome to another episode of Crossroads Rebuild. My name is Steven and today we are finally working on the BMW 330xi, the E90 3 Series BMW. It has been far too long and it's about time that we got this car fixed. This is actually not the first time I've gotten started on this car. Uh, I got started a few weeks ago on it and realized I had ordered a wrong part. In fact, I had actually recorded an introduction, taken the wheel off, got the car jacked up, and was getting ready to start uh, replacing parts when I realized I made a bonehead mistake and ordered the wrong thing. Hello and welcome to another episode of Crossroads Rebuild. My name is Steven and this is my 2006 BMW 330xi. It's a beautiful day in Indiana, so I think it's time to get started working on the BMW. Well, it feels like it's been forever since we've had an opportunity to work on the BMW. Actually, I haven't worked on the BMW yet. I've just shown it to you. I've teased you with it and it's been sitting here now for like two months. I am finally done with the Fusion, waiting on the paperwork for that so that I can get it retitled. But we're going to finally get started on the BMW. Just a reminder for you, you can kind of see here that uh, it was hit here in the passenger side uh, rear wheel and uh, the, what they call the, the dog leg section of the back passenger door. And uh, so we're going to go ahead and first thing, get this car running again. So I'm going to get it lifted up, take the wheel off, and I believe I have everything I need to fix the suspension damage so that this car will be drivable again. Well, this is not the check-in I wanted to, to have right now, but I've got bad news. Um, I ordered a wrong part. Um, instead of ordering both of the control arms, I ordered one of the control arms and I accidentally ordered uh, a track rod strut brace. Um, I'm not sure how I did that other than I just wasn't paying attention. Anyway, I've ordered the other part that I need, so I'm real bummed uh, to not be able to take advantage of this beautiful day. Uh, but you can only do what you can do, and we're going to roll with it, so I'll check back in with you once I've got uh, the correct part here. So I got that part ordered, got that part in, hopefully nothing else is wrong, and uh, today I've got my friend Scotty with me, he's going to help me get this uh, get this suspension fixed up, get the parts replaced. My wife Erica is going to probably help out as well, getting a little bit of uh, running one of the cameras. So let's go ahead and get started.
there's your problem. Took quite a hit on this one. The other part, Scotty, can you hand me that other one? I don't have the uh, new part to con uh, compare to, but if you can see the twist in that one, it's supposed to be straight. Uh, so, got both parts out. It took a lot longer than expected. I'm always optimistic that I can get things out quickly. Uh, and I'm usually wrong. <laughs> but anyway, we got them out. So now that these are out, we'll try to get the new ones put back in. It was not without sweat, sweat, blood, and tears, but look at that. The car is sitting with a wheel pointed in a normal direction. No more crazy negative camber. I'll show you a couple of pictures. I'll put them on the screen now of the parts installed. Uh, it didn't go as smoothly as we wanted, but it is on there. Still need to replace the shocks, uh, but it's getting dark and late. So now that uh, the main damaged components are replaced, the wheel is on, the car's on the ground. I'm gonna get the rest of these cars out of the way. And then we are going to take the BMW for a drive for the first time. As I was going through all the photos and videos for this episode, I realized I never recorded a conclusion to the video. So this is kind of a conclusion well after the fact. Uh, but um, as you can kind of see, my driveway is pretty empty right now. I, uh, I just have my normal daily driver cars in there. Sorry about that uh, really rough looking garage. Anyway, the reason for that is because, uh, well, the Fusion's gone. It's been sold. And the BMW, now that the suspension is all fixed, is in the shop. It's over at my buddy's frame shop. And I'll have an episode hopefully coming out soon uh, regarding updates on that. Uh, but all these projects are now uh, moving on uh, to the next stages. BMW's in the next stages, I should say. And then I'll have a wrap-up video coming out on the Fusion where I'll go over uh, prices and uh, how everything went down there at the end with the Fusion. Uh, just to kind of bring that project to a... To a uh, to a conclusion. So I've got that going on um, and then I've got a couple of other things in the works as well. Um, I have the F-150 that you saw a few episodes ago. We've got some mods that we're going to do on that uh, hopefully in the next couple of weeks and then uh, I have two other car projects in the works including one that'll be a little bit of a, a little bit different for uh, for me certainly it'll be a, a first for me and a little bit different than some of the things we've worked on so far on this channel uh, but I hope that uh, it'll be something you'll enjoy watching I'm looking forward to getting into it I also have a 
kind of a, a, an update or a new piece of news. I'm not going to bring it up right now, but I'll have that in an upcoming episode, hopefully here pretty shortly as well. So thank you for watching this video. I really appreciate it. Thank you for coming back to watch, even though it's been so long since the last episode. And if you are a first time viewer, I encourage you please to go ahead and subscribe and hit the notification bell so you can be updated anytime that I upload a new episode. And then also stay tuned for upcoming episodes. I've got several in the works. Also go ahead and check me out on social media. I'll put those links right here on the screen on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. You can follow me there uh, for updates along the way, photos and updates on things going on. I encourage you follow me on social media. Thank you again for watching. Stay tuned for upcoming episodes. We'll catch you then. Well, there's your problem. <laughs> <laughs> Blooper at the end. <laughs>